Welcome of UFC Unlimited Fight Channel. And coming up next, it's a UFC welterweight division matchup. Strikers in this division, sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You wanted to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Two years apart, these two fighters, some differences in height and reach as well. And now to get us started, Ladies here's first buck. This is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC Welterweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. Richie Boy! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. definite striker taking on a true five-tool play. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the jump. Big kick lands. He blocks the punch. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, wow! Head kick! Oh, nice high kick. Straight 
strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick. He somehow is managing to land it so much for him. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Oh, nice job to land it. Knee to the body. Man, I wish I was that tall. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Flips the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, and there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by Lee. Ninety seconds now to go in round one. Oh, is that a good knee to the body there by Lee? He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. There's no tell on that leg kick. Checks the leg kick. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Nice body kick. Big call from punch lands. Now he gets back to range. 20 seconds to go. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Horn sounds for the yeah. end of round one. All right, now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. Take a deep breath. Now listen, you probably lost that round. I need you to be first. All right, round two is now upon Ready us. Fight. Pretty competitive first five Ready. minutes, I thought. It's exactly what we expected. We expected when we saw this on the match sheet that these two guys were evenly matched. Let's see who really takes control as we go into the second round. Let your hands go. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Big punch lands through the middle. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Relax, relax. Keep Lee gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's one and done more often than not. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole <laughs> platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found a set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, perfect timing on the Superman punch. Big head kick lands. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Just missed with the left there. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Trying to kick the leg out. And he caught the kick. And there comes the separation now. Lee's shot there is blocked. The center line slips the punch. Got clip with the right hand. Big kick land. 
And both guys really throwing with authority. Ooh, blocks the shot. Nice. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. All right, that's the end of round number two. All right, no Telestrator for DC tonight, but we'll get you some replays. And if you like face punching, that was a good round. Yeah, where's my Telestrator, man? I want to draw this action. But yeah, John, you're right. It was the striking, it was the punches that really did allow him to take control of this round. All right, so another round is now underway. Pretty good action over the previous 10 minutes. Your thoughts on what we might see? Both of the guys really picking up the action, put their foot on the gas, and really start to drive it home approach the end of the fight and we're still so evenly matched and the fight has been so close to this point. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Gotta find a way to move those feet. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. instance it most certainly did. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Hands high, hands high. Big kick lands. Head kick there, we'll see if he can finish. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, big head kick. Nice straight punch. Nice job landing the knee there. He's got a lot of size for this division and put it to good use there. Just out of range with that kick attempt. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. He can't even, he can barely stand. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Look at him 
drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, that's a good right hand. Blocks the shot. Just misses with the straight left hand. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Nice punch here. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Able to check that kick as well. Straight right hand, no good. All right, less than three minutes remain in round four. He loaded up there with that high kick. Big knee to the body. He's got the turtle in that kick. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. And he landed the right hand there. Ooh, what a punch. He just misses there with the left. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Both fighters hanging down in the pocket and both landing. Back to the leg kick now. That one's no good. Rips the body there. Under a minute now to go. Nice head kick. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Pretty significant welt to the left side. He's got to whip his hip into that kick. And he landed a nice hook shot there, DC. He landed the hook exactly where he needed it to be and do it with ill intent. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. Let's check out some of the action, DC. What a display of just sheer punching in that last round. I mean, he looks like a boxer. He looks like a professional boxer out there throwing and stringing those combinations together. He landed those big punches over and over again, and it was this one right here that really did change the tide of the round. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. That was some serious precision striking on display in the previous round. Found his openings upstairs and closed the show. He has landed at an alarming rate. His opponent needs to get his head off the center line. He's walking into him with his head straight up, not moving, trying to engage without changing the angles. That is why he is getting brutalized right now. Great punch landing with so much power. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh, and he caught the kick. Unable to connect there. Big body kick. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Punch over the top. Three minutes now to go in the fight. Visibly limping here. Over and over, that big body. And now he's got the tie clinch. Oh, that straight punch. 
knocked his head in the wrong direction. Really putting his opponent on notice. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got to hurt very bad. Oh, he got that bow to the target very quickly. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, that is a nice straight punch by him there. He's got it all going tonight. No wasted actions. No loopy punches. He's going right to the target. Nice body kick right into the open. Big roundhouse now, just misses. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Big leg kick lands. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC, connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. 20 seconds to go in the fight. Trying to establish that jab once again. Official decision now in, the buff has it. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so the judges are in agreement tonight. He is your winner by unanimous decision. Certainly pretty easy fight to score, I thought. Yeah, I thought it was an easy fight to score. Whereas his opponent had a few moments, he was the one that truly did lead all the interactions. He's the person.